Hey guys, welcome back to M P Seven. This is Key here, and this is Rush, the Jamaican in the building, aka Sensational. I am back in other place. Is it me one more time? Sensational. You see me? Wagwan, Wagwan, our good and faithful people. Wagwan, indeed, as you can see by the time today, we're getting to Atlanta. I gotta do. I gotta do that little drum line thing, you know? I gotta do that little... You think about the wrong person. No, I'm thinking about the right person. Not really thinking no. about the right... I'm thinking about the, the, the action of the state. You know, you gotta do that little drum line. You do a little dance, and you do that little stuff. In Atlanta, you do the steps. But that's not only Atlanta I know, that that. but you know, it's, why are we carrying on and fighting about a little drum line? Anyway, let's get into it. You're this. thinking about the movie Drum Line, and that consists of Nick Cannon. No, I'm not actually thinking about Nick Cannon. I was just saying, I'm just giving a little homage to the drum line. You know what I mean? The, to the Atlanta down south vibes, you know, that's what I'm trying to get into. You know, welcome to Atlanta. You know, okay. you know brrr, pum, 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 pum. What? And again, why have we just been like, really, really, like five minutes just going through this? Yo, anyway, let's get into Atlanta. Okay, so as we know, this is a show created by Donald Glover. Yes. Um, well, this is his second show. There was another show called Swarm, I yeah. believe. We will definitely get into that one. I heard pretty good things about that one. We will um, be checking it we out. Did, me and Rush did technically watch this show. Yeah, but we were watching a few. We didn't really get into it like we're about to get into it now. We're going to watch all four seasons. Yes. All four seasons. Yes. Um, it's a little sad that it's only four, but we get it. He wants to get back into his acting. Yeah. And, yeah. you know, being um, more of a sitcom. Director, creator, and producer of of amazing shows so far um i believe this is the pinnacle of two actors that that i believe this is their start that actually get themselves well known yes in and future pro future projects that they had um and are still growing knowing. and are still growing in future projects of what my partner is saying right now because they are we are seeing a few of them popping up into a few things that is actually so you like know they're making a name for themselves yeah, too. Which is thumbs up to them, you get me? So you never know. A little thing here could lead to something big in the future. Definitely, definitely. Well, without further ado, let's get into season one, episode one of Atlanta. Ooh. Alfred. That's his name. <laughs> Wait. Wait, I was not I was not expecting someone to I was like not that. expecting someone to say world star. It was about that life at that time. Well, it's still it. Well, yes. No, nobody can really say World Star no more. Yeah. Then we just record it and post it. If it gets, you know, posted on World Star, it gets posted on World Star. But yeah, nobody really. I don't really hear about people saying World Star anymore like that. Yeah. No, they just post post it on whatever streaming platform and just that's it. Awesome, bro. Nobody's stunning on anybody here. No sin on anyone here. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yo, this is like you're for real though. This is man talk right here. We can settle it, but my car was not involved, man. Hold on, hold on, man. I'm getting crazy deja vu right now. Okay, where's the dog? With the Texas on. <laughs> <laughs> See? Are you right though? <laughs> What are you right though? No, he's tripping. I ain't tripping. No, he man, just this said. This man is having crazy deja vu. All right. Deja vu does happen, but why did he interrupt the whole conversation? Be like, this looks so familiar. Where's the dog with the Texas tattoo? I don't even see a tattoo on the dog. He was saying Texas, know. but it didn't say Texas. But it was a dog. <laughs> Whatever. 
<laughs> no. Yeah, it's in the floor. Man, you know what it is. Like playing in the hood, man. Why are we even talking, man? Watch shit. What's going on? What's good? That shit should be going now. World star. There you go again. Okay, well, what's up? Yeah, I got my people waiting right over there. What's up, baby? What's up? Let's go. What's up? Ain't he wearing your shirt, but in colorful? Yeah. Kinda, of, sorta. Of. See the dog with a Texas tattoo? He does have a Texas tattoo right Texas there, though. Texas state tattoo, not the mm -hmm. word Texas. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So many different guys shot. That's deep. I think it's about society, cause like, oh, who's the girl? <laughs> I don't know. Why, why, why is that the first thing you go to, though? I don't know. She was fat. <laughs> <laughs> not interesting. Okay. <laughs> you jealous? I'm just supporting <laughs> your story because she lives here. I promise she won't be at my parents' house. I'll pick her up after work. And if you're gonna be staying here, I'm gonna need your help with rent. <laughs> I'll, I'll give it to you tonight. He's a baby daddy. Oh, probably like eleven. Eleven. Earn. Earn is out. Are you earn? <laughs> Got him. <laughs> How do you look? Hi. Hey, I'm gonna give you an extra flag. As long as you keep flipping your pants. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> like, I got you. <laughs> oh, my God. Mm -hmm. Ooh, get him, get him, get him. <laughs> You say you want to be a music video, you get me the artists after work. You get me? Some of my time it could be water, some of my time it could be flower, some of my time it could be hey, who knows? You want to be a music video. The same, the artist got to visualize its creation. <laughs> I'm either gonna be your friend or I'm either gonna kill you though. Is it a, is it or that's a welcome or shank you though? That is a welcome. Is it or or you get me there? I'm gonna give you some cookie, I'm gonna give you this. One or the other. You gonna get something. You gonna get something. Either gonna go up, down, on the down, up, 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 up. Something, something. Somebody get something. Oh, or for the intruder cookie. Both I you get both of them too. Wop wop. It all depends. <laughs> and why is he masked up too? Like, why are you masked up? They're in the, probably they probably broken everything so they know who you he is. He probably thought it was the cops, so probably. With the mask up like that? Maybe. I know you know shots or nothing. Alright, though. No. Maybe. That's what I said, maybe. Alright, uh, see? Took one. That's how funerals work. Alfred. <laughs> You already, Malcolm, okay? You have that already. What you really need is a silent wild card. Somebody who's about the money, the opportunity, who can play both sides if needed. Oh, like Don Lemon. <laughs> <laughs> I can't! Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's 4.30. <laughs> wait. Three years along, y'all. I guess. I don't think I know what happened. I really think you don't. 
Sometimes, who the one press Byron first? Daisy. That's it. Yeah, Daisy. All right. Never seen a cat sweat before. Sweat right now. Daisy. What's up, dude? Earth? Yo, what's up, man? Yo, dude. He's coming from that dumpster? No. How are you? Too bad. So I call him from the side. It's just like, really, nigga? Mm -hmm. What though? You actually said that? Yeah, I had to. Cool. You know that song, Paper Boy? Yeah, Paper Boy by Paper Boy. Yeah, I've heard it. Shit's fine. I'm still stuck on the N word coming out of his mouth. Yeah, for real. Yeah. Where is I even slapping him though? Really play it. I don't have five hundred dollars. I make five fifteen plus commission. I gotta pay rent tonight, and my parents won't let me in the house. It's like those drug commercials, only not funny. You know how niggas out here are. He's still saying it. Hey, hey. Hey, can I have to say nigga around you? What? Yeah, right. I'll break my foot in his ass. <laughs> right. Thank you. That's what he should have done the whole conversation. I was waiting for it too. He didn't do it. He didn't do it. I was either fool. And then when he went to that group of three he black said, guys. He said, hey dude. Hey dude. He didn't do it. But since he was cool with him and know him. I didn't know he's a fool. He's a fool. He, he let it. Did. He let it, he, he knows he's gonna it. let it slide. Uh huh. Hey, hey, Auntie. Oh, hey, Lottie. Hey, bring Lottie over here. Let me say to my cousin. That's okay. She getting the contact, huh? That's <laughs> <laughs> that new leather you smell it. You smell it wrong. I'm gonna smell it wrong your head. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta wear white, you know that. Huh? All right. Um, anyway, I know you don't know me. My name's Darius. Um, I was just wondering. Can I measure your tree? <laughs> I'm like, All right, that's nice for you to introduce yourself. But, bro, talk about, he's so high, he's like, Can I measure your tree? tree? I'm like, you know what? I'm like, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Yes, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sure. Not on my, pro no, not sure. on my property, though. Not on my property, though. You break your neck, you know, or break your arm. That's insurance on me. It's not on my property, though. Go, go, go somewhere else. <laughs> okay. It was so high. Excellent. Can I measure your tree? Yeah, go ahead. I know the father's face is going to be hilarious. <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> I said no. no. I think we need to know. Duh! Look, I got a question. I like that. That's right. Mm -hmm. I ain't about you over. <laughs> I just keep. Oh, so about the conversation. I mean, that's what I said. I like. Some people just supposed to lose. In the universe, I mean, like, are there just some people on Is that Nutella? Yep, the man making a sandwich. To be Where'd he get the bread from? Oh, the pocket. Like, really? You don't see what the man doing? Nope. This, this, this is a symptom of a bite sandwich. <laughs> nah, good, man. You don't bite this sandwich. <laughs> Still left the Nutella and he he gone. You hope he didn't get robbed. I mean, he, got he went robbed. in the forest with the dog. Yep, one with a tattoo. He should have bite the sandwich. Hey man, this is Dave. He works at 106.5. He likes your stuff, so he's got good taste. Actually, to a fault. Yo, tell him that floor right is no. so funny. I'm telling him. Oh, uh. <laughs> 
Yeah, this is, uh, this is I feel like he's he's not like you said. He know he could do it with only him. Yep. But since he made two new black people, the joke <laughs> is not gonna be the same because he's not saying uh, the N word with it. Nope. Nope, he's gonna be very Caucasian. Yeah. To the T. Yeah. Yeah. I had to go to the booth, calmly take him aside, look him right in the eyes and just said, Really? I don't know, man. I, I like Flo Rock. Mom said you enjoy rap right too. <laughs> yeah, you know, it was a funny story, man. I don't know why I didn't tell that. Yeah, I don't know. He thought he was going to say it too. Mom got rump in the trunk. Thank you. <laughs> His mom is a mess. Yep. She said, My free time is done. That's his actual photo. <laughs> That's his actual photo. Over a damaged car. So how was the first Yeah, it was still funny. You know, I still it was good. So I like it. I like the the balance of seriousness and comedy. Yes. Which is really good and sometimes you don't really get that in first episodes of the Yeah. You know it'd be a either either a miss. Or, miss or whatever it is. It would be such a, a, a good opener, then you have to wait maybe two or well, three or, episodes before it actually gets good. But actually, with this, you actually kind of see the kind of a little bit of the plot, a little bit of a little bit of the backstory of some of them. You get a little bit of feel of the characters. You you, you sense what they're kind of going through. You 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 actually kind of in kind of interact with them, I guess, in in in, in the retrospect. Mm -hmm. You know, and I like this as the opener. Yeah, and then um. What got me as well is like the I guess you could say the main character in the show and then the sub characters. Main character is Charles Gambino's character, which is why well, I keep saying Charles Gambino. Donald Glover's character mm -hmm. is his name is Ernest. He see it seems like he's a college dropout. But yeah. he, he lied to his family saying that he took a break from school. And then we found out from his cousin that it's been three years that you haven't gone back to school. So that's a very long break. Buddy boy. He He's a father, mm -hmm. but he's, I guess he's in an off and on relationship with his baby mother. His parents kicked him out. I guess because he's not doing what he's supposed to do. Not even probably helping out with the bills. Like not they said, because this. he's not paying. So, he might as well kick you out. So basically, this man is homeless! Very much so. And then, the sub-characters we get into. His mom, dad, girlfriend. I mean, not girlfriend, baby mother. And then, I think the main ones we're going to mainly see is his cousin, Paperboy, a.k.a. Darius. No, 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 not Darius. <laughs> His cousin Darius paper boy, mm -hmm. and then we get the the mysterious Darius who smokes a lot. I guess he's he's the yogi. He's, he's his cousin's Al, Al. That's what his cousin's name is, Al, mm -hmm. short, short for Albert. They give these people educational names, Albert and Ernest. Most definitely, you know, but we are progressive people. <laughs> and he's. I just feel like they just put him there for the comedy for pure joy as someone who don't really have a purpose yet yet mm -hmm. from what i see he's just there for com comedy relief mm -hmm. and just spell out whatever is <laughs> on his mind <laughs> yeah like client like go measure in the tree like okay yeah but then again maybe you will play on the future stuff that do comes up you know because you gotta kind of Listen to the crazy people. <laughs> True. And then I think the main plot of this is um, Earn, Earn, 
helping his cousin Al make it big as a rapper in Atlanta. Yep. I think that's that's, that's it. Main plot. Yeah. And everyday life mm -hmm. with them both. So yeah. I think that's the main plot. But it's a good main plot though. It was very sensational. <laughs> Any other thoughts No, just getting ready for the next one. You get me? Because I I guess so many times when you start watching one of these, you start bringing back up a few stuff and you just want to catch back up and see what's going on then the next one, the next one. And now you actually have like four episodes, I mean not four episodes, four seasons. So I, I feel like I want to go binge. <laughs> you know, because... You know what I mean? Okay. And then the main co co conversation that hit me, like you, like I said, I said I liked. You was trying to like I said, I, like I said, like I said, like I said, like earlier <laughs> that I said I liked. So she was confused with what I was talking about. When Al was having a serious conversation with his uncle Ern's mm -hmm. dad about should I trust him? Mm -hmm. Because he's still keeping a lot of secret. Ernest is still keeping a lot of secrets from him, and. You feel like Ern, Ernest will be like holding him back of what he's trying to do as a up and coming rapper. So his father, you know, father said that, yeah, I feel where you're coming from. I understand where you're coming from. But he knows his son well. He said once my son sets his mind to it, something, he will stay focused on that. Yeah, he's like a horse with blinders. You don't see nothing here, don't see nothing there, until the mission is accomplished, basically. True. And which is which is I actually like, you know, certain people can't have that fortitude or mentality to just block everything else out and just try to get that mission accomplished. Yeah, but that yeah, true. But then he also the father was also like. Yeah, he does that, but it's, be it's on, on your time. it's it's still it's your his. your decision to take him on as your manager if mm -hmm. you want to. Still, you come down to it as you want him to be your manager. Or it's not. up to you. It's up to you. You know. Right. So yeah. Right. So I like it. Hopefully, you all like it too. Hopefully, you all continue watching or start watching with us too, and leave your little comments. You know, let us know. Let what us know you like. who's your favorite character on the mm -hmm. show. You know, and what's your what was your favorite episodes from season one that you really liked as we progress on? Yes. You know? I, I was your favorite highlight or moment or some of the craziest thing one of the characters actually said to you that you know it's like wait a minute that don't make sense or wait a minute that do make sense or something that really strikes you out because I think there was a lot of little moments here and there a little scenes that some of these characters actually said that really made me like. Hmm. Like that dude. Let's go plant it. Let's go measure You're the tree. Definitely right about that. And also, you know, let us know in each episode down below. I love. We've been loving you guys' comments, even with our Abbott Elementary. We love your comments. We love. Please continue. You know, it. conversation with you guys. Conversation. Conversation. Having conversation with you guys on these the topics that we both all enjoy. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, that's mostly it. So we are coming to a close. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like the content that we have on this channel, please subscribe down below. Please hit that notification bell so you can stay up to date with our latest and greatest video guys. Please remember to tell a friend. To make a friend. To keep a friend. So we, we all can, can be friends. friends. Yes, Zimmy. Zimmy. Ah, big up to one Zimmy Dan. Big up to. Fire Furnace, big up to uh, Real Re Entertainment, big up to Key, big up to all of our viewers and all of our subscribers. Please stay level and please big up to the creator and the producers of Atlanta because this is a sub, this is a little um, thing that we're going to be progressing and continue going if you like this guy. You see me? Most definitely. And we'll see you in the next one. one. You see me? Sensational. Oh. This is Blandy Dread again.